do this skinny, okay? <laughs> Topping our headlines this morning, oh. we got a new comeback for cuisine queen Paula Dean. After that regrettable racial slur scandal, Dean was dropped by the Food Network, Target, and Walmart and lost her book deal. But now she's launching a comeback, premiering a daily radio show, a weekly podcast, and now a brand new cookbook. But not just any cookbook, this one will feature 200 light recipes and low fat updates to 20 of her classic dishes. She's not known for having low fat fare, but. She's trying something different. Mm -hmm. And some words of advice this morning. A recipe for sweet success from Madonna with love to Kanye West. With love, that's the key part. In the latest Rolling Stone cover story, the material girl doling out six pearls of wisdom to the Louis Vuitton Dawn. Starting with, don't take things so seriously. In particular, don't go to award shows looking for justice. And frankly, just keep on rocking. I like that. Keep on rocking. <laughs> Madonna also urged West to put down the smartphone. Stop talking. Stop tweeting. Just finish the song because she says he does have the talent. She says he needs to keep things interesting. Hey, that's wise words from a woman who once, who's always countlessly reinvented herself, right? She has. And uh, who else are reinventing, reinventing themselves these days? Uh, we couldn't believe our eyes when we saw this. Say it ain't so. Actor Jared Leto cut off his hair. There you go. Now we can see it. Here he is just a few days before as we knew him, that you saw that picture. Now he looks like a completely new man. Yeah, 43-year-old Oscar winner chopped off his mane for an upcoming movie, Suicide Squad, in which he'll be playing the Joker. Suicide Squad starts filming next month in Toronto. And finally, we like her hair just the way it is. Yeah, CBS apparently likes Judge Judy uh, <laughs> right where she is, making tons of money for everybody involved. There she is, Judge Judy. Uh, has extended her whopping contract with CBS TV distribution for another three years for a guaranteed five more years of Judge Judy. The term of the deal has not been disclosed, but the 72-year-old is reportedly among the highest paid personalities on television. She's earning about $47 million a year. What? Is that right? 47? That is correct. That was under her old contract. And I'm sure that number will stay up. But she's been making a lot of money for them for a long time. Congrats to her. She's good at what she does. Isn't she? she is very good yeah. at it.